Welcome back. I'm Dr. Harry with Hadley Chiropractic. Today we're going to be talking about a plantar fascia stretch. So I probably gave you this because you're either having tightness through the foot, up into the calf, or you've already been diagnosed with plantar fasciitis by somebody else. Uh, the things we're going to be working on here is stretching the bottom of the foot, similar to how you would use a foam roller to stretch your mid-back. So there's a couple of tools, none of them are very expensive, that you can use this with. I'm going to show you quickly all of them. So Therabrand makes a great roller right this. The idea behind this is you can either use it at room temperature or you can freeze it as well, or you can put BioFreeze or some other cooling agent on the top of this if you like that kind of stuff. What you're gonna be doing, place, start by placing it right in the center of your arch here and rolling back and forth all the way from the back of your heel all the way to the tip of your toes where the plantar fascia attaches. You're stretching this out, focusing especially on the spots that are very tender. You can come back and forth and work on this. This is something you're doing for one to two minutes at a maximum, 30 seconds at the minimum, multiple times throughout the day. It's much more important to do this multiple times than to spend down, sit down and do this for 20 minutes all at once. Uh, the next option that I like also is a lacrosse ball. This is a very good one because most people have something like this around. You could do a tennis ball. Uh, uh, golf ball is a little bit too hard, a little bit too small. Uh, lacrosse ball is a pretty good happy medium. And the same thing in through here, you're finding the tight spots and focusing on them. If say right here into the heel, he's feeling it a lot, you can give it a small circle, something like this, down and through the toes, just stretching it out. My very favorite option, which is actually the cheapest, is go get a 90 cent water bottle out of a vending machine, freeze this puppy so it's a nice frozen solid uh, water bottle. You can reuse this, and then this has a nice cooling effect at the end of the day when you get home, if your feet are killing you, you're gonna look forward to this. Same idea, stretching this out, focusing on the spots that are especially tight. That's it, super simple, very easy, and this is one that I look forward to at the end of the day.